When the whole career began, and when the early, actually the early 70s when I started performing, I had no idea where it was going to go. Once the first record, The Cat Came Back, was out, that changed my life. You know, that was now a commitment to vinyl, but I never did any of this with the, with the intention of, of any, uh, of any uh, kudos or rewards. I did it because it felt like the right thing to do. I worked with special needs kids when I was growing up. My sister Susie was born with Down syndrome. You know, <clears throat> so I think when you get to a point, when I got to that point of understanding the value of music in, in the lives of a child, that became my foundation. That was the only reason that I was doing any, any of this, was just because it felt like the right connection and people were giving me the feedback, uh, continuing that, saying this is, this is a good path. I like what you're doing, I like what you're singing. I like the message that you're, 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 you're conveying. And then along the way, you know, the Order of, Order of Canada, the Order of Manitoba, working with, uh, with, with UNICEF, um, with UNESCO, with the Down Syndrome Society, all of these other branches sort of evolved that, that gave me connection to my music. But it's, it, it's, uh, it's been an amazing journey, certainly. The values of, of, of humanity are what carry me all the time. I've done a lot of work with First Nation uh, organizations and their series of values of truth, honesty, courage, humility, um, wisdom are all connected to animals along the way. And those are the are values in, in any religion, I believe. And, uh, and those are the things that I hold on to and, and believe and understand and, uh, and, and try to bring messages through that into my music, certainly. My sister Susie, who I mentioned, was born with Down syndrome. She died in the early 70s. My dad died about a year later. And so I had these two mortality checks that that rocked my world and, uh, and allowed me to look more deeply into my path to realize that uh, music was the one thing that gave me bliss and, uh, and energy in my life. If you are just looking for the excitement of music, what, I mean, they, then it's just a matter of listening to whatever sounds there are in, in, in the world. And in, inevitably there will be albums or, or particular songs that will, that will just get a hold of you and become the earworms of your life and you will always hold on to them. It's, uh, it's like any creativity, but, but the, the bottom line is pay attention to yourself. Pay attention to the thoughts and feelings that you have as an individual and what are the things that give you bliss and excitement in your life. And no matter what you do.